What's up, Peak Timers? Welcome to today's showcase from Peak Time Racing. My name is Phil. We are doing Lamborghinis today, the most requested showcase that I've had. We did a Ferrari one. We've done a couple of other different ones before. Now we have got some Lamborghinis. You can see a few of them kind of hiding just right back there. Thank you very much, everyone who has joined in. If you guys are just joining in, make sure you guys smash that thumbs up. Thank you so much if you have already. And we're gonna get right into a bunch of different Lamborghinis. So essentially, if you like Lamborghinis, this is definitely the one to watch. We're gonna kind of mix it up as well. We're not gonna go in order of like, say, early Lamborghini Countach all the way up to the Centenario Road. So we're gonna mix it up a little bit. So follow along. Thank you very much. I see Ralph Racer moderating the chat for us right now. Thank you very much. And uh, make sure everyone keeps it clean. If you guys have questions and stuff, uh, post them down below and I'll do my best to answer as many questions as I can. Uh, I will possibly need your guys' help to, uh, whoa, 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 I'm dropping cars here. I will need your guys' help to maybe possibly tell me which sets some of these are from. A lot of, uh, a lot of people ask, oh, where do you get this one or which set was this from? Um, and I remember some of them, not all of them, because there's just so many Lamborghinis. Uh, so we're going to start it off with the Lamborghini Gallardo or Gallardo, if you say it that way, or Gallardo, if you say it the other way. Uh, there we go. We got the Lamborghini Gallardo. We've got the first one in the green colored variation. Thank you very much, everyone who is joining on in, guys. Again, we're doing the Lamborghini Showcase. How is everyone doing? Thank you very much. You have 17 Lamborghinis. Awesome, awesome. There we go. Lamborghini Gallardo, green one. So we got a the base Lamborghini Gallardos in green. Uh, we got a couple of different base ones. Then we got some super Legero ones. This one's like a tangerine colored Gallardo right here. Got the five star wheels on there as well. If you guys like Lamborghinis, smash that thumbs up button. I bet you, I bet you some of you do. I bet you some of you do. Uh, this is the newest Lamborghini Gallardo release. This one's come in some multi-packs. I've seen it in a three multi-pack, a 10 multi-pack, a 20 multi-pack but it is a multi-pack exclusive car. Haven't seen it in the main lines yet. Lamborghini Gallardo in the yellow. It's got a little bit newer wheels on there as well. I'll put that one there. We're not gonna have enough room to put all the Lamborghinis here. I'm gonna have to move them as we go on. Uh, this one is a Speed Machines Lamborghini. This is the Policia edition, the Italian police car. If you guys don't know the story in real life, the Lamborghini donated a uh, the Italian police, they donated a Lamborghini Gallardo with the Italian police livery on there. It looks really cool. This one is a Speed Machines variation. So if you got it in the Speed Machines pack way back then, then you're lucky. If you want to get it now, you probably have to pay a little bit more for it because they're, they're getting up there, getting up there quite expensive. Moving on to the Super Legera variations. Uh, so if you're not familiar with the Super Legera, it's the, the fast lightweight variation similar to the uh, Lamborghini Huracan Performante, which is what the Performantes are to the original Huracans. And this is the Super Legera, which is the fast version of the original Gallardos. There we go, lightweight version. Uh, they all have the spoiler, they got like a ground effects kit. There's a lot of different color variations of this one from Hot Wheels. Uh, the Miria Hot Wheels ID one, yes, we have that one here. We'll show you that one as well. If you guys didn't watch it in my other videos. Uh, this one is a Forza exclusive set. Addition, this one does have the real riders on there. It's like a metal base on there as well. So it's a really, really cool one. Uh, we'll put some special ones up in the rotating spindle here. Uh, you know what, this is probably my favorite, uh, the Italian police Gallardo. We'll put that one up there. That one's really cool. I like that one. Uh, we've got Matt White's, per from, or, or sorry, Super Legera, Matt White, Lamborghini Super Legera. Really, really cool one. I'm liking that one. Here, we'll replace where the police edition guard I went put it there got a little gas station there too maybe we'll have to fill that one up as well uh, we've got a green super legera uh, they call it the LP 570-4 super legera there you go if you want to see the bottom of it you can see the bottom there uh, there we go we're on Gallardo's right now we'll go to some different ones next we've got uh, another one this is an orange one I think this one is from the Forza set as far as I remember that's my favorite guard. Oh, you, you like the green one. Of course, Rob Verso likes the green one. Uh, there we go. That one's really cool. And this is another green one as well. I actually like this green one better. I don't know, actually. They're both kind of good. I like I like the, the glossy look 
on this one. The green Superleggera, yes, I figured rival. There you go, there's your two green Superleggeras. Uh, this one I believe is from the new, or the Exotics 5 pack. Was it, was it this year's Exotics 5? Or maybe it was last year's, I can't remember. It was a recent Exotics 5 pack. Um, then we've got uh, this one, which is a, a Real Riders. This is, I believe, the Fast and Furious one that was released recently. I think it was a Fast and Furious set. It's got the Real Riders, the metal base on it. It's a really, really cool one. It's got the weight to it. This year's five-pack. Thanks, Ravel. There we go. And this one, this is probably one of my favorite ones. I like blue on cars and the blue Superleggera. What's up, Javier? Thank you very much. Another moderator in the chat. Thanks, guys, for helping out. Appreciate it. Uh, everyone's going to keep it clean today, though, so you guys you guys are going to be good. Uh, so there we go. Those are our uh, regular Gallardos and then the Superleggera Gallardos. Um, I have a lot of different Lamborghinis. I have probably majority of all of the Hot Wheels Lamborghinis, um, but I might be missing some. And you know what? I'd love for you guys to comment down below for me uh, once we go through these, which color variations am I missing? So for the Gallardo, which color variations for the Gallardo I'm missing? I think, as far as I'm aware, I only have four. Uh, of the Gyarados. Uh, there's a lot of Huracan color variations. We'll go through those ones in a bit as well. Uh, let's move on to, uh, what else, What do we got here? Here, let's move on to, I'm gonna pull them all aside here so we can see them. Put them all in front of me right here. The Murcielago. Murcielago, we're not going in any order. Like I said, guys, I'm just kind of pulling different ones as we go. I don't know which ones we'll do next. Uh, Mercy Lago, lots of different uh, variations of the Mercy Lago. This is an orange Mercy Lago with the black wheels, chrome lip on them. I think it looks fantastic. Lamborghinis in orange look awesome. So good, so good, so good. Thank you very much for the notifications. I know some of you guys are getting the notifications now. Thank you very much for joining on. And guys, again, smash that thumbs up if you're just joining in. Appreciate all the thumbs up, guys. Helps me out. Uh, we got the green Murcielago with the chrome five-star wheels. Uh, oh, yes, the, the SVs. We'll do the SVs after this since this is part of the Murcielagos. There we go. Green Murcielago. Put that one up there. Uh, this one is from the Batman series. It was one of the new Batman ones, I believe. Uh, yes, you like the Batman one? There you go, Wesley, just in time. There's your Batman Mercy Lago. Perfect. Nice tempo work on this one in the front. Looks good on the back as well. Put that one down there. Uh, this one is really cool. This is kind of like a pearlish white Mercy Lago with the blacked out wheels. Uh, between the Mercilago and the Aventador, which one do you like better? Um, probably one of my favorite Lamborghinis is the Aventador, Aventador SV, which Hot Wheels does not make, but I do have an Aventador SV to show you guys today. So not a Hot Wheels one. Uh, I have an Aventador SV and SV Roadsters. So really cool ones, not Hot Wheels. We'll do those ones last. Uh, we've got uh, an orange one. This one, I believe, is the Fast and Furious one that was released recently in the Fast and Furious set. Good tempos on the front and back. I'd, I'd like them to redo the Mercy Lago casting. I don't think it's done 100% right. It doesn't look like a modernized casting. Like if you look at the the newer Reventons and the Chinchari Roadster, which we'll get to in a bit, they're a much better detailed casting. The Mercy Lago, they could do better. And also the the LP640, uh, I believe they should do the, the release of that Mercy Lago. Uh, this one is, I believe, a multi-pack one. Mercy Lago, and it's what, what color? Is this kind of a yellow? I guess it would be yellow. I know it's hard to tell my light. Sometimes my light's colors look a little bit different. So if I call colors differently, I blame my lights. <laughs> there we go. Put that one down over there. Probably gonna have to fill up the gas station in a second here. Uh, and this one looks like, uh, this one looks like an all yellow one as well. There we go. That's a nice one. That was from the Lamborghini set. Oh, that's right. That's right. This one was from the Lamborghini eight car set. Now I remember. Thank you. Again, help me out guys on uh, where the cars are from. A lot of them, I don't 100% know exactly uh, if they came in multi-packs and sets. Some, most of them I do, but there's some of them that I forgot. And I'm gonna have you guys helping me out, reminding me it helps. Uh, let's move on to, oh no, no, no. I was gonna show you the continuation of the Mercy Lagos. We've got the Mercy Lago SV. This one was from the Cars of the Decade series. Uh, it's kind of like an off-white color. I would have liked it to be more pure white, but as far as casting goes, this is my favorite Hot Wheels casting of all time. I'll actually bring down my favorite, favorite color variation and my favorite Hot Wheels casting of all time. The Speed Machines Yellow Murcielago SV. An absolute 
gorgeous casting. I just love the blacked out look at the bottom, the wing on it. Just everything about this casting is just awesome. Has to be my favorite Hot Wheels casting of all time. That's gonna actually replace our Police Edition Gallardo. I'll put that over there. Uh, what do we got next? What do we got next? We should go to, let's go, let's go over to something a little bit fun here. I'm pulling them all. I'm pulling them down over here. We've got the Urus. Uh, there is, what, six, about six different color variations I've got of the Urus. There it is. It's the Urus concept, actually. It's not technically the, the Urus. The new one is actually a little bit different. So this is the Urus concept. They haven't come out with the, the newer variation, which I'm hoping they do, because Hot Wheels has done that in the past where they've released, uh, they've released a, an updated version once it becomes production. They did it with the 918, the Porsche 918 Spider. they did that. So they had an original concept release, then they came out with the proper casting of it. There's an orange one with the black wheels. Uh, we got a green one. I think this one came in a multi-pack. I, I think this might have been one I got in a three-pack, I believe. That one looks really cool. That's a good good looking green color to it. For the Urus, we've got like a red one. Uh, do you not have the turquoise Mercer logo? It was in the Exotics five pack from like 2010. Ah, that's a good question. I may not have it. I may not have it. I can't remember. I I, I believe I'm, I got all the castings that I have. I have my Lamborghinis all stored together. So um, I, I might not actually have that Mercy logo. That's, that's a good one. Yes, help me out guys with ones that I don't have. With ones that I don't have, call out. If you see, if I go through all the castings, there's one that I don't have, let me know. Uh, this is like a tangerine one. This might've been one from the uh, Lamborghini 8-pack, I think. Possibly. Uh, do you have the Tamika Urus? I don't have the Tamika Urus, but I do have some Tamika Lamborghinis, which we'll get to. Uh, once we get through a lot of these, I'm actually going to put, you know what, let's put the Euroses out here. Uh, we'll put those out here. There's going to be Lamborghinis everywhere here in a second. I'm going to move my camera back a little bit here so you guys can see. Uh, we got the last of the Euros. We've got the, the pearlish white Euros. This one looks really cool. Good looking tampo on the front. Nice looking on the back as well. Cool looking casting, cool looking casting. Uh, hey Phil, awesome collection, racing fun. Thank you very much for joining in. Appreciate it. Uh, you're only missing the gold Countach from the Revealer series. I don't have the gold Countach. Uh, speaking of Countach, let's, let's get to the Countach. There's uh, quite a few Countaches here. Uh, there's a couple of different uh, casting variations of the Countach, which is interesting. Uh, Matchbox is gonna make the Euros. I didn't know that, that's interesting. Uh, Black Lamborghini Countach. Uh, we'll go through, we'll go through them a little bit faster here. Uh, we got the yellow Lamborghini Countach. I like these wheels. These are definitely like the Lamborghini-esque wheels. Like they look like the Diablo wheels. This one had it too. Isn't that cool? I like how they did that. Put some of the Countaches up here. Uh, we got a blue, blue Countach with the gold wheels, the Lamborghini riding on the side. This casting as well. I, I wish it just had the spoiler on these ones. I, li I like the, the Countach with the spoiler looks good. Uh, the blue and gold wheels, someone just asked if I have. Yes, there you go. <laughs> Good timing. Uh, there's two Countaches. I have three different color variations to this. This is the white one. These ones are fairly recent. Uh, they came out in the last couple of years. Uh, yes, I got some Diablos. We'll be going through those as well in a bit. Uh, we've got the red Countach, or sorry, the, yeah, the red Countach tuned. I thought there was an orange tuned Countach. I could be wrong though. Uh, we've got uh, this one right here with the cool gold wheels. Check out those big gold wheels. How's it going, guys? Thank you very much for joining. Smash that thumbs up. If you guys are just joining in, I appreciate it. Hello, everyone. Thank you for stopping by for our Lamborghini Showcase. Lots of Lamborghinis to go over today. Uh, we've got, uh, this is, I think, probably one of the first Lamborghinis that I ever got. It's like an early to mid-90s uh, Countach. You can see it's been played with. The suspension's, well, not really suspension, but the, the axles on there are a little bit bent as well. I've had this one for a long time, long time. Again, one of my first ones. Uh, McLaren 7, McLaren 720, which we have, uh, they're both different cars. I mean, the, the Senna is, is a track car. The, the 720S is a road car. They're both great cars. It'd be hard to pick. Uh, there we go. We've got another white one. This is different from this one. I feel like this is a little bit more updated variation of a casting, possibly. Uh, thank you very much. If I'm on the only hot, well, there's lots of good Hot Wheels YouTubers. There's lots of great ones. Uh, we got a red one. 
with the gold wheels with the Countach on the side. Th th these wheels were really, really popular uh, back in the 90s. Uh, like the, the 90s, the early 2000s, Hot Wheels used these wheels on like so many different castings. Uh, so we saw a lot of them. Uh, There's another one, another variation of that one, and it's got some updated newer wheels. I think this one is actually from the, uh, from the Lamborghini 8-pack set. Uh, somebody asking me, uh, was it Javier asking me about my opinions on the Corvette, the new 2020 Corvette? I give the new 2020 Corvette two thumbs up. I am in love with it. I absolutely love it. Um, I even was trying to convince my wife that I think we should order one, but uh, not, not for my time in life right now. Maybe in a few years. It just doesn't work for me with kids right now, but I love it. I absolutely love it. Uh, newer Lamborghini Countach castings, they redid this one. I love this casting. This casting they did right. They came, they came out with so many different Countach castings. They finally got the proportions right, and they came out with this one. Looks great. This one is the pace car variation in red, and then they released the pace car variation in white. There we go. Pace car variation in the white. Again, looks really good. You can see that they've got those uh, little lights on the top there. So what did they think? They said, well, you know what? That would make a great police car. So they came out with it in a police car, a blue Countach police car. And then they said, hey, well, it looked good in a black Countach pace car. So we got a black one as well. Really, really nice. Uh, what do I prefer, Lamborghini or Ferrari? Uh, I've been more truly a, a Ferrari guy growing up, but honestly, between Lamborghini, Ferrari, and McLaren, I, I'm a supercar lover. So I, I really, you really can't go wrong with either one of them. Uh, what should we go up next? What should we go up next here? We've got, I'm gonna pull some up here. Uh, we've got Aventurer J, Lamborghini Aventurer J. This is the green one. Uh, this one is a, I don't think it's a multi-pack car. Is it a multi-pack car? I think it is a multi-pack car. This one did. I actually pulled this one from a 50 multi-pack, but it has come in the 10 and the 20 multi-packs and possibly even in the three multi-pack as well. Uh, this one's a really cool one though. Someone's saying exotics five pack. I don't think this one's an exotics five pack. That's an, uh, it's a multi-pack car. Uh, this one is a really cool one. I love this one. I like blue. Um, I like Lamborghinis in a light blue. Look really, really cool. Uh, there we go. Ventura J in the light blue. Yeah, it's an exotics five pack. Is it really? I swear I had this one in a multi-pack as well. I'm pretty sure this one I have. I did get it in a, in a multi-pack. Uh, and then we've got a yellow one, yellow Aventura J. You guys know what's my favorite color? Yellow. Yellow Lamborghinis look good. Well, I mean, my favorite Hot Wheels casting is a yellow Lamborghini, so there we go. Yellow looks good. Then we got this one with the white wheels. These wheels look so good in white. I don't know what it is with, like, white wheels. I, I like white wheels, but are, are, they, uh, are they good for a real-life car? Probably not. They probably get really dirty, but they look cool. If you watch uh, a couple other, or one of the other YouTubers, Stradman, he's got his purple Lamborghini with the white wheels. Uh, this is the newest Aventador J, and the casting is, it's not an updated casting. I was thinking that possibly they did update it, but comparing it to older castings, it's literally identical. So it's just a recolor. Nothing wrong with the Aventador J though. I mean, it is kind of, it's, it's very concepty. Yes, I'd rather see an SVJ or an SV released. I totally agree. Uh, that's the Aventadors, uh, Aventador J, sorry. There's a lot of Aventadors. Um, you know what, I'm gonna have to move. I'm gonna move the Aventador Js as I as I hit my camera. I'll move some of these Countaches out of the way as well here. And we'll make room. We'll make room. Let's, let's do Huracons next. How about that? Let's go on to some Huracons here. It's a lot of different Huracons. We got Sesto Elementos, we got the Huracon. Super Trofeos, uh, there's so many good ones. Revent we got lots to go through still, guys. Stay tuned, lots. Huracan, red Huracan with the stripes. This one is a multi-pack car. Uh, yes, Huracan's my second favorite Lambo. What's your first favorite Lambo rival? I don't even know that. Love the red, looks fantastic. Uh, we got the yellow, yellow Huracan. Boom, Huracan's such a good looking car. It totally is, I love it. I absolutely love it. 
I wish they made Hot Wheels made this uh, the Performante, Huracan Performante. Uh, this one is the what is it called, Doctor Evil or something? It's a newer release, Huracan. But this one is a great, great looking casting. I think this color is fantastic. Real Riders metal base. That the wheels even look, or, or the wheels and tires even look like they're staggered, like 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 sticking out. They're just ah, oh, they're so good, so good, such a good Doctor Strange. That's what it is. I called it Doctor Evil. I don't know why I said Doctor Evil. Doctor Strange, Lamborghini. <laughs> yes, make fun of me. Feel free, make fun of me, guys. It's all good. Uh, we got the green one. Green. I know you guys are. Some of you guys are green fans. Green Huracan. Looks awesome. Love the green Huracan. Looks good. Lamborghinis in green look really good. Uh, Forza Edition Huracan, pearlish white color. Uh, would you have a Huracan Performante or, Hur or a Huracan Super Trofeo? Uh, I, I'm more of a street guy. I, I'd probably take the uh, the Performante, drive it on the street. There's not enough good tracks around me to drive drive cars like this. Uh, we've got uh, Forza Edition. This I guess this is there's two Forza Edition ones. This is the the like the mainline type Forza set. This is the the premium Forza set one. You can see much better details and stuff all around it. More details on the front of it. Forza Motorsports on the back. Metal base, real riders, all that looks really cool. And this is, uh, I think, is this an eight pack one? I think this might be the eight pack one. I can't remember. No, I don't think the APAC had it. This this was from a multi-pack then. I don't know, I don't know, I can't remember. You guys can correct me. The orange one with the black wheels and the big stripe down the middle. Huracan. Looks good, looks good. Uh, and since we're on Huracans, we might as well go to the Super Trofeos. And they've released a lot of different color variations of the Super Trofeos. So we'll go through all those. Uh, they're not in any order of release. We're just going to pick them up. Uh, White Huracan Super Trofeo. And this one came in... Uh, was this a five-pack one? I can't remember if this was a five-pack one or not. The red base, the white top and the red base. Or was this a was this a mystery one? I, I can't remember. There we go. Huracan Super Trofeo. Orange one. This one was in a main line. Orange with the black wheels. Orange looks really good. So good, so good. Love orange. Orange looks good. You know what? Let's start filling up our gas station here. Let's put the Super Trevos in the gas station. They can go in there and get their get their gas. Uh, yellow. You guys know how much I love yellow. There we go. Yellow Huracan Performante. Or no, I said Huracan Performante. White was also a mainline. That's true, that's true. Uh, Huracan Super Trofeo is what it is. These are all the Super Trails. Uh, we've got the gray one. This one, I believe, was a mainline as well. White is from Basics. That's right. Now, I do remember opening up is a basic one. Gray. Uh, this is like a like a, like a a kind of a lighter gray with the gray wheels. Looks good. How's it going? Thank you very much for joining, guys. Smash that thumbs up if you guys are just joining in. Thank you so much. I see all the likes already. You guys are awesome. Uh, green, which I believe came in a mainline as well. So many colors. My opinion is there's so many colors of the Super Trail because Hot Wheels wanted to give you a full Lamborghini race. That That's true. That's true. We might have to do a full Huracan Super Trail race. I, I, I don't know if I did one in the past before. Uh, do you have a working brain? I, I do. Sometimes. I do. It's all good. I gave you guys permission to make fun of me. Did I already show you an orange one? I might have already shown you an orange one. I think we doubled up on an orange one here. We did. There we go. Okay. So I got two of these ones. I tried to eliminate all the doubles because I do have a lot of these castings as doubles and triples and stuff like that. I tried to eliminate as many as I could, but obviously I didn't see that one. Our last one, the mystery one, 2019 Mystery Model Series 2 Matte Gloss Black. This one is probably the best one. I love this one. It looks so good. Execute the doubles. Get rid of the doubles. I know, I know. No, I keep doubles because uh, I race my cars. You guys know that. So a lot of times the there's ones that get damaged, but this one looks, this one looks so good. So good. All right, Huracan Super Trofeo. We'll put that one there. Uh, what should we go on to next? What do you guys want to go on to next? How about I'll let you guys decide. We've got Aventadors, uh, Veneno, Chincenarios, uh, Sesto Elementos, Diablos. Uh, we've got the Reventons. Uh, what do you guys want to go? 
Veneno, somebody said Veneno. Zed King said, Z King, Z King. Sorry, I'll say it the American way. Z King said Venenos. We'll switch it over to the Venenos. And we got the Venenos all right up here. Uh, there is the kind of a darker red Veneno. Looks good. Venenos, lots of them up here. We've got the, I hope I have all the Venenos here. Am I missing any up here? Possibly, possibly not. Uh, we got the white one. This is a really cool one. Whites, I like the black wheels with the white on the, the outside there. So cool. The black stripe down the middle. Looks good on the side. And yeah, I do have the Forza Edition set one. This is my favorite Chinchinario, I think, the blue one. This one looks so good. This is a multi-pack one. So good looking though. Like blue, like th this type of blue on a Lamborghini looks fantastic. And even I like like the, the colored striping on the side. I don't know if this is yellow or like a lime green around the, the actual t uh, wheels and tires there. Looks really, really good. Veneno, new Veneno coming out this year. That's right, there is another one coming out in the Exotics. I think, it, was it the Exotics ones this year? This year? I think it was. Uh, this is the Zamac Edition Veneno. This one looks really good. If you guys like Zamac cars, this is one to have. The Zamac Edition Veneno. That one looks good. Uh, this was, I think it was one of the first ones that I got, the orange one. This one came out in around 2013. Black wheels, orange all around. Looks really, really good though. They did a good job on the Veneno. I think the Veneno is a great casting. They did a fantastic job on. Uh, this is one of the Forza ones. So this is the one, the only one with the real riders on there and it's got the metal base as well. So this one looks really, really good. Nice work on the front, nice uh, tampa work and stuff on the front as well. There we go. Gran Turismo, not Forza. Thank you, Josh. That's right, you are right. Should we execute doubles for Phil? <laughs> Boom to the doubles. Get rid of them, no, no, no. We need the doubles. Green, Lamborghini Veneno. This one looks good as well. Uh, I can't remember which pack this one came out. I think this might've been just a mainline one. Green Lamborghini Veneno. I just realized I've got two chin scenarios up here. You guys can, can't see them. There's one off camera here. Uh, let's go to Sesto Elemento since I've got them beside me here. Sesto Elemento. This one was from the Lamborghini 8-pack. Black Sesto Elemento. It's got the the lime. It's kind of lime green or yellow. I don't know. It's probably, I would say it's more yellow. Sometimes hard to tell between like a really bright green and a yellow. But this one looks really cool. Sesto Elemento. Lots of Sesto Elemento fans here. I know that. Uh, we've got the white one. This one I think might have been a multi-pack one. It's like, it's like a matte white finish. I'm liking that one. Looks really good. Uh, we've got a green one. This one is like, I feel like it's missing something. I don't know what it is. Maybe not. Maybe it's just me. I feel like it's just not complete around this area. But this one still looks good. Green. Green Lamborghinis look really good. Uh, we got the kind of the maroonish red one. There we go. Maroon red. Lamborghini Sesto Elemento. Uh, we'll put that one there. Uh, then we've got like this kind of like lighter, it's like a tealish color to it, which looks really good. I think that suits it pretty well. Although for a Sesto, for a Sesto Elemento, you probably want a more hardcore color. I've actually seen the Sesto Elemento in real life, the original one. It looks really cool. Uh, and then this one is the multi-pack one. Uh, the, I don't, was it this year's multi-pack? I think it was this year's 2019 multi-pack one. And the Sesto Elemento came out in this one. And it's kind of like a copperish gold color. I think it was, looks really cool. Five-pack exotics, yes, this one is a five-packs ones. So that one's really cool. Gotta like that one. Here, we're gonna move the camera down a little bit so you can see a bunch of them up here. Uh, what else we got, what else we got? Let's go over to Diablos. Lamborghini Diablos. Uh, this one was, last year's was red, okay. Uh, this was, they called this the Diablo 6.0, but it's just the standard Diablo. Uh, this was like a special edition pack. I got it on eBay. Um, and yeah, I opened it up, but yeah, they called this the 6.0, but it's not. Metal base though, real riders on it. I think it looks good though. I'd like to see a new Diablo come back into the Hot Wheels main lines. Final run, yeah, this might've been a final run one. Uh, do you have the gray Sesto Elemento? The gray one? I do have the gray one. It's funny you say that. I do have the gray one. 
I'm not sure where I put it though. Did it get away from me? Okay, we'll, we'll check in a little bit. I might have put it somewhere else. Uh, we got this one here. Uh, Sesto need for sp Sesto Elemental need for speed. No, there just no, is there a need for speed one? There might be a need for speed one. Uh, this one, what is this? like a bluish color? The Diablo wheels on there. Hurry up, do the chin scenarios. Yes, yeah, so we'll do the we'll do the chin scenario next. There's only one though. There's only one chin scenario. Uh, but I do actually I do have some more chin scenarios for non Hot Wheels, which we'll get to in a second. Uh, another Diablo with some crazy writing on the side. I don't even have a Diablo. Yeah, the Diablos they don't make anymore. So unless you got them a while ago, they're going to be hard to get. Because I, I, I haven't seen like a, a new release of the Diablos anytime recently. Uh, this is one of the original Diablos that I have. Actually, the next one would be... Here, I'm going to show them together. These are the two... Along with the Countach, these are the two other Lamborghinis that I've had for a long time. You can see how bashed up this one is. I definitely played with this one a lot when I was a kid. Look at all the, the damage on the back of this one. This one's pretty good, actually. This one might have been an, uh, another one that I opened up, but the original one I had of this one had a lot of damage as well. But with the Diablo riding on the side, I'll worn out on that one. There we go. We can see it on the side of that. And these are those uh, 90s and, and late 2000 wheels. And the last Diablo that I have is this one right here with the big Lamborghini Diablo on the side of it. That's really neat. And what does this say on the top here? Final run. Oh, okay, this is the final run. 2003 final run, Hot Wheels final run. I'm gonna need Diablo, blacked out. Kind of a nice matte finish with the black on top. Thank you very much for all the thumbs up, guys. Smash that thumbs up. You guys are just joining in. I appreciate all the likes. You guys are killing it today. You guys are doing awesome. All right, what did I say next? Chen scenario? I think I did say Chen Scenario. There we go. Lamborghini Chen Scenario. I know how much you guys love this one. I love this one as well. I'm not even a big Chen Scenario fan in real life, but when they released this casting, they just did an excellent, excellent job on it. So if you guys don't have this Chen Scenario yet, make sure you get it, find it in stores. Um, you should be able to find it in stores right now. I found like five of them in stores the other day. I didn't buy them all, but I was like, wow. It's pretty cool to see. But yes, there we go. The Chen scenario. Look at the back even. They did it well. The big diffuser on the back. Plastic base, obviously, as well. Chen scenario Roadster. I don't know why they didn't come with the coupe. They came with the Roadster right away. But I like Roadsters. I like uh, the, the Aventadors and the Mercy Lagos and all that. They look really good as a Roadster. But so good. The Chen scenario. All right. What should we do next? Should we do Reventons? We'll save the Aventadors to last. I do have the super, oh, 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 actually, I do have some other ones here to show you first. Here, before we get to the, the Raventons. Uh, this is, what is, what is this called? The Estoque, the Estoque. This one, I believe, is an eight-pack one. We saw the SUVs, the Eurises. We did those before, so if you guys were, didn't watch that, you'll have to rewind it to watch those. There is your Estoque. Estoque, C sedan's underrated. Yeah, it would be cool if they made a, a four-door sedan in a Lamborghini, but uh, I feel like they having the SUV Lamborghini is, that. that's it, that's basically it. Uh, another Estoque, the gray one, and uh, as far as racing and tournaments down my track, I think this one might have been one that won one of our Lamborghini tournaments, like a big Lamborghini tournament. So this is actually a fast car down the Hot Wheels track. I like the paint on this one, looks good. It's like a sparkly gray color. It is a unique car, it is a unique car, but uh, think of companies like Aston Martin that came out with their four-door Aston Martin Rapide, which is now not selling, so they're having to cancel that. So coming out with a four-door luxury car now, um, there's the market's just SUVs and sports cars, right? So they, they don't want to come out with any ones. Uh, thank you very much, Redline99. Appreciate it. White Lamborghini Estoque with the gold wheels. Love gold wheels. Gold wheels look so cool on cars. I don't know what it is. It just looks different. Thanks for joining back. There we go. Look at that. Look at that. Beautiful. Beautiful. A stoke, Lamborghini a stoke. Uh, what else do we have? We got the Chinson, uh, sorry, we got the Reventons. I uh, got some Reventons on the board there. We got some Reventons here. So let's go over Reventons. This I believe was an eight pack Reventon for the Lamborghini eight pack. This is kind of like a, uh, what is it? Like a pearly white color with the stripe on there. Looks good. We've got the gray wheels on there. Looks nice. And then there's another white one of the, this is the, the coupe, the non-roadster ones. Uh, white one with the blacked out wheels, the white lip on there. That one looks fantastic as well. There we go. 
And we've got the black one. Black one, very glossy black with the chromed out wheels. And this one has like a tan interior to it. Or I don't know, I don't know if you'd even call that tan. A very, a very off tan. <laughs> there we go. Nice, nice, nice. And now there's a lot of the Reventon Roadsters, which I think look awesome. I love this casting, the Reventon Roadster. Um, I can't remember which one there was. One of them was in the eight pack. Oh yeah, I know the one in the eight pack. It's on the board. It's right there. That one right there that I'm pointing to. Uh, there we go. And then we've got the green one. This is a newer release one. This one came out this year, so you can get your hands on this one. This is a really good one. I like it. I mean, maybe, I, I don't know if the wheels really suit this one. It's hard to say. The green Roadster does look good though. Just, just the green and even the stripe on it looks great. And we got some ones on the board. This is the Target Edition, Target Exclusive Edition. There we go. Oh, oh, I just remembered there is also the white Target one, which I have on my wall. I'll grab that one in a second. Uh, there we go. This one looks, I love the red. The red looks fantastic on this one. So good, so good. That's a great looking one. Uh, we've got, this is a kind of a dark gray, or it's kind of like an uh, like a matte finish gray to this one, and it's got a little bit of sparkle to it as well. A really cool paint job on that. It feels different because of the paint job. Like, it feels like it's a different weight of some sort. I can't remember where this one came from, though. There we go. Uh, that's probably, as far as original Reventon colors, that's probably going to be the most most original color you can get to from the original one. This is a silver eight pack exclusive one, Lamborghini eight pack one. I like this color. I like I like how silver, silver shows a car's lines really well. So if you wanna see the, the lines of a car, get any silver car or even a lighter gray car and you can see the lines of it very, very well. But just look at that. There's so many good lines on the Reventon Roadster and that's it. Looks very, very good. And uh, there's one more that I have on my wall. Give me a second. I'll get up here and grab it. And this is an unreleased one. Uh, and this one I believe is the Kmart exclusive edition. This one is a unrivet one, so it's not screwed together yet. It comes all apart and stuff like that. But that looks fantastic. We got the, the whites with the, the red and the green. Um, and Funny enough, the releases this year, uh, we've got, these are all the releases for 2019 as well. The whites, the red, and the green, which is your Italian flag. There you go, Italian flag. And it's also the, actually also the colors of my logo, not, not exactly those shades, but um, I did that purposely because of the Italian flag. Italian cars, so good. But this one looks really good. I like that one, I like that one. And we'll actually put that one up here since it's kind of coming apart there. Uh, what do we got next? What do we got next? We've got, uh, I'll show you actually, no, no, no. We'll do this one. We'll do this one first and then we'll get to the Ventadors. Uh, we've got the Hot Wheels ID one, Mira. There we go. Lamborghini 71, Lamborghini Mira P400 SV. Um, if you guys don't know, it's from the brand new Hot Wheels ID set. You can pick that up. This one's on Amazon. Uh, check in my Hot Wheels ID videos. I've got the link to it. So if you guys want to buy it, it's like $6.99. Not bad. Not bad. Lamborghini Ghost Agosta. I don't even think I have any of those. Agosta? Or 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 was it? Is this the one? Estoke? Is that one you're talking about? I don't have any Agostas, I don't believe. Um, I don't even know if they made that one. But loving the Mira. The Mira looks so good. So good, so good, so good. This one's so good. Hot Wheels ID Mira. Mira. Uh, Lamborghini Aventador. Lamborghini Aventador. I do have the supercharger and we'll do that one last, but we've got matte white Lamborghini Aventador. I've got all the Lamborghini Aventador colors, except there is the brand new uh, RLC exclusive release one. That one I don't have. I'm trying to get my hands on that one. I really like that one. Um, check it up on eBay. You can get them for around 40 bucks right now, but... I'm hoping I can get them cheaper. Uh, yellow mystery one. This is an, this is a harder one to find. The yellow one. It was from it was part of a mystery series set way back. Black wheels. I'm liking this one. Looks good. Looks good. Looks good. Uh, matte black variation. Uh, this one is definitely harder to find. A little bit more expensive to get if you want this one now, but it's a good one. 
There we go. Aventador. Uh, we've got the, oh, I should have done it this way around. This one was released, released first. Uh, Lamborghini Aventador Mira Homage Edition. Uh, and they have the supercharger and variation of this one, which I'll show you at the end. And then they re-released it in this blue color, which was, I believe, a Kmart exclusive? Or was it a Target exclusive? Uh, Kmart or Target exclusive? One of the two. But I love this one. This one is so nice looking. I love like the bottom with the Mira Homage gold and then the gold wheels. This one looks 10 out of 10. Love it. Kmart, thank you very much. Kmart exclusive was this one. That's right, I got the Kmart box and I got that one included, now I remember. Uh, this one I think was an eight pack one, eight pack release, I believe, possibly, yes, eight pack. Or it was, no, or no, this was, no, sorry, 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 this is a five pack exclusive. Five pack exclusive, there we go. The Gumball 3000 Aventador, yes, that's the one that I wanna get, I don't have, that's the only release I don't have. Silver, as you guys know, I said silver looks good on any car because you can see the beautiful lines of it and especially of the cool looking Lamborghini Aventador. Oh, the Aventador looks so good. Looks so good. Uh, no, this is the APAC exclusive one. Oh, uh, that's right, I did already correct myself. Sorry, I'm gonna grab my drink of water here for a second as I speak, and you guys can look at this one. There we go. All right, APAC exclusive Lamborghini Aventador. And this one, I believe, was a Forza. Was this a Forza or a Gran Turismo? I think it's Gran Turismo, actually. I can't remember exactly. It's kind of a tangerine-ish type of color for it. Uh, Matchbox Elmo 2, I don't think I have that one. Or maybe I do. No, 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 I don't. I don't have that one out. Forza, thank you very much. And this was one of the original releases ones that I got, the orange one. This one came in a main line. Orange with the black wheels, which is the same color of one that I saw of the first Lamborghini Aventador that I saw in real life when it first came out. I saw an Aventador in this orange with black wheels and I was like, ah, that's such a cool looking car. Uh, green, this is a multi-pack one. Green with the kind of uh, a white stripe and I like how it starts kind of big and it goes smaller. That looks pretty cool. Looks like it's going really fast. That's a really cool one. And these gray wheels look fantastic. There we go. And last but definitely not least, boom, the Super Treasure Hunt Lamborghini Aventador Mira Homage Edition. Doesn't that look awesome? These wheels we've never seen before. We've got the nice real riders on there. And you know what? Let's compare it with the mainline variation of it. The mainline variation just looks so good though too. Like for, for a Super Treasure Hunt, it's gotta be one of the best ones that we've seen in the last couple of years. Love it, love it, love it, love it. From the back. It's obviously got the Spectra flame job on there. Uh, I don't have the Aventador J Super yet. Yet. I say yet, but I haven't actually found it. I'm hoping to find it. Uh, we're gonna put that one right here. It can spin. There we go, those are two great Lamborghini castings. Uh, all right, uh, non-Hot Wheels ones that I've got. There's some really good non-Hot Wheels castings of Lamborghinis. We'll start off with the Mira, Matchbox Mira. And this one came, this one was just like, it was like a special edition one. I can't remember exactly uh, where it came from, but it was, I got it in the last year. Lamborghini Mira. This one looks fantastic. The detail is so good. I actually kind of want to compare it to the, the Hot Wheels variation. This is the Hot Wheels one from the Hot Wheels ID. There's your Matchbox one. I almost feel like the Matchbox one is more proportionate. I think it is. It's hard to say, but I, can't, I just can't believe this car was released in the 70s. It's just such a good looking car. I'm actually shocked that the values of them right now haven't shot up more than what they have. I mean, you can still get these for a million dollars, which doesn't, it sounds like a lot, but a million dollars for a collector classic car like this. I mean, that's not much when Ferrari 250 GTOs are trading for $70 million now. Uh, we've got the Matchbox Lamborghini Gallardo. This one's a police edition one. Uh, this is from the, the Glo Globe Travelers set. And I've still, I've actually seen these ones in store recently. I've seen them in store. Um, but uh, yeah, it's a good one. Real Riders on there. 
plastic base. Uh, it's more of a plastic body, and it's got the nice looking wheels on there. I like it. I think it looks good. I think it looks good. All right, now on to some other, I'll just move over here and grab them. Oh, I've got a lot, maybe not a lot of them. Uh, this has to be, this is my favorite Lamborghini. Boom, my favorite Lamborghini uh, in real life, Aventador SV Roadster. Uh, this one is made by Majorette. There you go, Lamborghini Aventador Roadster from Majorette. Uh, I love this casting. It looks fantastic. The only thing I don't like is the wheel gap. I feel like if it was lowered a bit more to, or even have a little bit smaller wheels, that would fit in better. But Aventador Roadster, SV Roadster. Doesn't that look so good? Color of this one looks good. I mean, such a cool casting. You can get this one on eBay. I think it's around 10 bucks or so. But when I saw this, I was like, oh, I wish, I wish Hot Wheels would make an Aventador SV Roadster. Yes, the wheels are too big. That's the only problem. But if you don't look at the wheels, you just look at the casting. The casting is fantastic. Really, really good. Nice detail. It's all plastic, but still very, very nice detail. That one's a great one. Uh, we've got some Centenarios from Tamika, Tamika, however you want to say it. There is your Centenarios. We can compare it to the, the Hot Wheels Centenario. We'll take one of the Hot Wheels Centenarios from down here. There we go. This is, even though the, the Hot Wheels one is a, a roadster, you, you get the idea. How's it going, Lone Star Diecast? Thanks for joining in. We got the green. Good detail on the back. There we go. This is this is the original color one when the uh, Chen Scenario first came out. This is this is the color that they came out with it. It looks really cool though. I like the highlighting, the green highlighting there. It looks really good. All right, Chen Scenario, and what do we got next? We've got uh, another Tamika Veneno. This one was like a Tamika four pack, I believe. There is your Lamborghini Veneno. And we got another Tamika Police. Is this one Tamika? Yeah, it is Tamika. This is the Dubai Police car. Imitation of the coolest police force in the world with all the crazy supercars and performance cars that they have in the Dubai Police fleet. And then we've got that one made after that. And we've got a couple other Huracan Performantes from Tamika as well. This is like a matte orange. That's a great casting. That looks good. That's why we, come on Hot Wheels, release a Huracan Performante for Hot Wheels. That would be so cool. And we got the yellow one of it as well. I think yellow looks fantastic as you guys know. I love my yellow. It's a good casting though. I think it's, it's good, it's proportionate. It's maybe a slightly bigger scale. Like let, let me just grab a regular Huracan right here. Yeah, so you can see it's 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 bigger. It's a bigger casting for sure. So it's I think it's a one in sixty two scale. I don't know if it says on the bottom. Yeah, it does. One in sixty two. There we go. I was right. Perfect. One in sixty two. So slightly bigger than Hot Wheels, but a great looking casting nonetheless. Yes, one in sixty two. Uh, and then we've got some Tarmac Works Lamborghini. Aventador SV, this one looks so good. Tarmac works, more expensive castings. Uh, they roll, but not not very well. These are made to be kind of displays. And the mirrors, you can see they're kind of like a, like a piece of rubber stuck on. So a lot more details to these ones, but they look great. They just look absolutely great. Look at that, I like, even the light bar looks so good on there. Such a good casting, such a good casting. Uh, will Hot Wheels make the C8? I really hope they do. I mean, they've made every Corvette, so they have to make the C8. Uh, then we got the Lamborghini Aventador SV. This is another one, a police one. I think this is a French police, if I'm not mistaken. I don't know, somebody correct me in the comments. Which country police car is this from? Is it French? Maybe not, maybe not. But Aventador SV with the big wang. I feel like this wing's a little bit more raised than what the real life one is, but I'm not gonna complain. It looks good. Indonesia? Is it Indonesia, please? Thank you. Interesting, I did not know that. 
looks great. But that's it. That is it, guys. That is all the Lamborghinis that I have. I'll move back a little bit. We'll shove some Lamborghinis up. Is there any other ones that uh, you guys want to see that maybe you just joined in you guys want to see? I could show you, show you a couple extra ones. So good. So good. Uh, yes, any questions, comments, anything open discussion now about Lamborghinis? Let me know what you guys think. What's your favorite Lamborghini? Favorite Hot Wheels Lamborghini? Uh, have you heard about the two new Supers? Yes, I have. I have. Holy cow, Mua. Yes. <laughs> You're missing the Roll Patrol Murcielago. Roll Patrol. All right, I'll have to look that one up. Uh, are you going to stream sometime soon? Yes, Wesley. Sorry, it's been a busy summer. I know I have not been streaming on my gaming channel lately. I'm trying my best to get that in there. Hopefully I can soon. Uh, Eurus, yes, we got those. The 4GT Super, yes, Rival. That one's going to be awesome. I cannot wait for that. Uh, would you get a Murcielago or an Aventador? Um, I don't know. I like, like I said, you guys, my, one of my favorite Lamborghinis is the Aventador SV Roadster. I'd probably take that, but then my favorite Hot Wheels casting is the Murcielago SV. It's hard to say. The SV Lamborghinis are so cool. I love the SV Lamborghinis. Uh, you think they'll ever make an Apollo IE? I don't think Hot Wheels will. We've There actually is two uh, castings of the Apollo IE made by other manufacturers. Um, so I don't know if Hot Wheels will make it. Uh, would you like to see a Murcielago Roadster from Hot Wheels? Yes, 100%, Josh. I would love to see it. Uh, the Super Veloce was cool, yes. Hot Wheels Miria ID, that's your favorite one? Yes, it's a good one, it's a good one. It's a fantastic one. Uh, any other questions, guys? Any other questions? Uh, we, if we need a small Devil 16, Devil 16 is is a, an imaginary car. The, the company that made it, that claimed it had 5,000 horsepower, it's, it's, it's all a hoax, it's not even a real car. So Hot, I don't think Hot Wheels is gonna involved with that. SVJ, yes, we'd love to see an SVJ. Uh, come out from Hot Wheels. And an SV, just an SV Lamborghini Aventador from Hot Wheels would be great. Um, have you got the Pizza Planet truck? I haven't even heard about that. Uh, Spire Spitter, how's it going? Thank you very much for asking. Uh, so, so many cool Lamborghinis. Yes, I'm doing well, Hot Wheels Road Beast. Thanks, guys. Smash the thumbs up again. If you guys are just joining in, smash the thumbs up. Uh, do I have any Lamborghini events? Uh, Lamborghini LMO2s? Not that I know of. Um, if I'm missing, again, guys, if you guys know if I'm missing any Lamborghini castings, let me know in the comments down below. A couple of you guys have pointed out I was missing. There's a gray Sesto that I I swear I do have it, but I must have missed put it somewhere else. But I, I'm pretty sure I do have it. Uh, I have one you are missing. What's that one, Josh? Uh, Mercedes 6x6, yes, in Matchbox I have it. It's a great casting. Uh, do a Corvette showcase next live stream? I could do that. We've got lots of Corvettes. We could do a Corvette one. Uh, you need a purple Mercy Lago with real rares. I actually, I funny enough, I do have that one. Um, it is my kids took it and it's upstairs somewhere. But I do have the purple Mercy, uh, the purple one with the real riders. Uh, thank you, Artex. Uh, do I have the need for speed Lamborghini? Yes. Uh, that was this. No, that's that's not the need for speed one. Uh, the, this is the. That's the. Uh, oh, this is the Fast and Furious one. The need for speed one I do have. I'm pretty sure I do. Uh, what's my favorite Lamborghini? My favorite Lamborghini in real life, uh, Ventura SV. Uh, do you have the McLaren Charge Hunt? Uh, there is no McLaren Charge Hunt. Sesto Elemento Movie Edition. Is there a Movie Edition one? Possibly. Uh, the red Sesto Elemento from this year's Exotics 5 pack. That's your favorite one? Where is that one? Is it this one? This one right here? That one's a good one. That one looks fantastic. Looks really good. Uh, a very nice collection. Though. Thank you very much. Again, any other last minute questions, guys? If you guys want to see any other Lamborghinis that uh, you might have missed, I can show you guys again quickly. Wasn't there a purple P1? No, I don't believe so. For P1, there wasn't. Uh, Zamac Lamborghini Venture J. Um, is there a Zamac Venture or J? I don't have that one. I don't think there is. A, is I might have to look one up. I'll look that one up later. I like the Tarmac Lamborghinis. Yes, the Tarmac Works ones are great. Like, especially this one. The Aventura SV Tarmac Works, such a good looking casting. They did a great job at it. Uh, Camaro Showcase, possibly we could do that one. Lamborghini Aventador in black colors, yes. Red Aventador J, that's a great one too. Uh, the, I'm, I'm, look, I'm looking for my Aventador J's. Oh, we got the, uh, oh, red one. Oh, maybe I don't have the red one. Is there a red one? Ooh, I'm missing the red one as well. Thank you guys. 
Uh, <laughs> again, thanks for the help, guys. Uh, all right, guys, we're gonna end it up there today. Ford showcase, yes, we could do a Ford GT showcase. Not, or, or we we could do maybe a Ford showcase where we could show. There's a lot of Mustangs though, a lot of Mustangs. But uh, we're gonna end it off right there, guys. Watch back. If you guys want to see all the Lamborghinis, thank you so much again for watching. Make sure you guys smash that thumbs up. It helps me with all those YouTube algorithms and that. So thank you so much, guys. We will catch you on the next one. Peace.